Aria, Yamo, have you seen your sister Claire? Didn't she tell you she was going over to her friend's house? No, she didn't. What friend's house did she go to? Serenity's house. You know, the girl you met yesterday? I see. That's very unlike her not to tell me. Maybe she forgot. I highly doubt that. She's in a lot of trouble. Oh boy. Hey, Aria. Micah, I'm a dog. Hey. I wanted to ask you a question. Yeah, of course. Let me just... What is it? I know this is a family-owned business, but I was wondering if you all were hiring, possibly? Oh, um, I, I don't know. It is a family-owned business. And I know, but since we're friends, I kind of wanted to ask for the favor because my family is, like, crumbling in money right now. So, as a friend, I was just wondering if you could possibly try to convince your mom to let me have a job here? Uh, yeah, sure. Let me grab you a job application. Thanks, Aria. You're the best. Yeah, it's no problem, but I can't make any guarantees. I understand. Yeah, so just fill that out real quick and I'll give it to my mom. Thanks, Aria. You're a good friend. Yep, a good friend. Yeah, so here you go. All right, well, I'll give it to my mom as soon as I can. I also really wanted to ask you another question. Oh yeah, what is it? I know you and Kinsley aren't the best of friends, but she's been acting strange lately and I just don't know what's up with her. I was thinking maybe you knew, because I know Paisley's your friend, and they've been hanging out a lot together. Oh, my god, I, I have no idea. No, it's okay, I was just curious as all. Well. Ma'am, I really wanted to buy this milk here. Yeah, sure, I'll ring you up in the front. Thank you. Excuse me, sir. I should probably get to work. I need my milk, okay, ma'am? I'll see you around. Man. I sure hope so. <sighs> All right, your total is 234. Here you go. All right, and here's your change. Thank you. What a kind lady. Claire, there you are. You know, Mom is gonna kill you for not telling her where you were going, right? I'm not in the mood, are you? What's got you down in the dumps? Me and Serenity had an argument. I, I don't really want to talk about it right now. Claire, it's okay. I mean, Claire, why didn't you tell me you were going out with your friends? It was just Serenity and we just went over to her house. It's not really a big deal. Yes, but Claire, you need to tell me where you are at all times. Yeah, I know. I just didn't think it was that big of a deal. I mean... What I just say, I need to know just in case of an emergency. Of course it's a big deal, and you know that. That's very unlike you not to tell me anything. I know, sorry, Mom. Okay, well, I'm sorry to do this, Claire, but you are grounded. What? That's a first. You cannot just run around wherever you want without telling me where you're going. Plus, I already have some weird vibes from that Serenity girl I met yesterday. Weird vibes? What do you mean? Claire, just go to your room. Aria, get back on register. I'm gonna be baking in the back. Ugh, this is so unfair. Sorry, Claire. Ugh. When you're done, I need to talk to you. Thank you both for meeting me here at my house. We just really need to talk about the plan. Yeah, of course. What the hell happened to your voice? And what's up with that beanie? That looks like it came out of the Target boy section. Probably because it is. You still didn't answer the question about your voice. I've just been taking some medication. <laughs> medication doesn't change your voice. It's just testosterone treatment. All right, no one cares about your tomboy stage, Tara. All right. Uh, Can we start talking about the plan? So for the plan this time, I kind of thought of like printing out embarrassing pictures of Claire and like put them on everyone's locker. 
Oh my god, that would actually be so funny. But like, shouldn't we be attacking Arya directly if we're trying to, you know, hurt her? I mean, yeah, but we've been over this. The only way to hurt Arya is through Claire. I just think we should go on a different approach, like affecting Arya directly. I just thought it'd be more fun with Claire. Hmm. Anyways, back to what I was saying. They're not gonna answer that? It wasn't that Micah? Yeah, but he's still mad at me for being involved in Claire getting pied in the face. I just really don't want to talk about that right now. Oh well, but back to what I'm saying. We should definitely go for Arya this time. And of course, I came up with my own plan. Like what? Like, you know, that party tomorrow night. We can think of a new plan and do it there. Or what do you have in mind? Okay, so like, we should totally like get some hairspray and like, you know, one of those lighters and completely burn her tail. Watch her run around the entire party screaming in pain. I'm sorry, what? Yeah, wouldn't that be hilarious? I think you might be just a little bit psychotic. Yeah, that seems like it would hurt her. I mean, yeah, it does, it's Arya. I mean, she stole your boyfriend. I mean, not yet. And you know, whatever Arya did to you. She did nothing to me, but what did she do to you exactly? Just something personal. I ain't gonna talk about it. Is this how she almost caught you with those locker note things? You did actually catch me, thank you very much. Oh, so that's why you don't like her. No, it's still for a different reason, but back to the plant. So maybe instead of involving fire, maybe we can think of like dyeing her fur. Wouldn't that like harm her skin if she's like allergic to it? Yeah, so who cares? It has a small possibility anyways. I think you just want to conflict harm on her. And so what if I do? So what? I mean, you're gonna be injuring her, maybe even possibly killing her? I thought you hated Aria, why does it matter to you? I mean, I don't like her, but like, I don't want her to die or get hurt because of us. It seems like you don't really hate her, you seem like you still want to be friends with her. Hastily, I think you've changed. Changed? Seriously? I haven't changed, you all just don't agree with my ideas because they're psychotic. You know what, I think I can just carry out my own plans and you all can carry out your own. I think we're done here. You better not go through with anything. I'll do whatever I want. And since you all ain't going to the party tomorrow night, I'll just perform it there. Bye. Has she lost her mind? Apparently. Well, what are we gonna do about that? She can't just go off and do that. Exactly, we can't let her go and possibly kill Arya. Like, I hate Arya, but like, I can't allow that to happen to her. Oh yeah, girl, like, I totally get you there. So are we going to that party tomorrow night? I guess we'll have to, to make sure that crazy pants doesn't do anything. Fun, I'm gonna be so excited for this. We're only there to stop Paisley. I know, I know. Oh god, that shift was awful. Sometimes I wish I didn't work in the bakery, sometimes I wish I did. It just kind of depends, though. So. Claire, are you okay? She wants me to, to decide. What? I told her I don't know, and she told me to decide and figure it out. Well, that's not pressuring at all. Claire, if you don't know your sexuality, just take your time to figure it out. Don't make her rush into things with things that you aren't comfortable with. It's not that I'm not comfortable with it. It's just that it's pressuring and it's giving me anxiety because I don't know what I want. I don't know who I want. And I don't know if I will ever know who I want, Claire. I mean, I guess it's like, I'll never know. Just do what I say and just take your time. Like, she won't even answer her text messages or anything. Like, we both got invited to this party tonight, why aren't you answering? Can't we just put our differences aside and just go to a party? Aren't you grounded anyways? I mean, yeah, but I can just, you know, there's a window right there so I can sneak out. Claire, that's not like you. What's not like me? That. That black bow. You never wear black. You love pink, pink, and sometimes blue. So, Hardy, I'm just 
dressing. Where did you even get a black bow? Do you even own a black bow? Well, this is yours, but that's not the point. That, that is mine. What, what? Look, I'll give it back to you tonight after the party. So do you wanna go? No, I'm not a party person. Okay then, so while I'm gone partying, you can stay here and make sure mom doesn't find out. <sighs> fine, fine. Good. Now, I'ma get going. I don't wanna be late. Whose party even is this? That guy and girl I met today at lunch? His name is Kane, her name is Blake, and uh, they invited me. It's his party. They're not, there better not be drugs and alcohol at this party. It's just a party. Anyways, I'm gonna crawl out through this window. Hey, don't, don't do drugs or alcohol. I'll see you later tonight, keep the window unlocked. I can't have you getting hurt. Mm -hmm. Hmm.